morning everyone welcome back to another vlog in today's vlog i'll be showing you a day in my life on a clinic day so on today as of today monday i have an 8 a.m to 6 p.m clinic which sometimes kind of get extended uh i'm really tired but i really just woke up and it's seven o'clock and i have to be at my clinic by eight but since i have almost everything done i know i just have to take a shower and have some breakfast and go so let's get this day started so for breakfast on such days i usually have something very light so i'm just having one sandwich uh, either jam or peanut butter today i made a peanut butter and jam sandwich and along with that i usually like to have a cup of coffee like cold coffee nice frothy coffee um that that's just enough for me like just one sandwich and i usually pack the other sandwich for my lunch because on such hectic days i usually don't like to eat a lot then i picked up my favorite scrubs from fabletics and got ready so let's get the hookers in and then we just doing a very girly fit check before I head to the clinics. I have to walk uh, around 15 minutes today. So here am I walking out. It's always nice to see, you know, people going to work early in the morning on streets of New York. I mean, everyone is like, you know, <laughs> hustling and in such a rush. And just seeing that kind of makes my day. That's the most beautiful Empire State Building. I see it on my route to uh college every day and then i walked and then finally i was at nyu dentistry the place where i study and also kind of work i was just in time for the huddle and then i finally reached my floor and my clinic so usually it's like 1d3 and 1d4 they share a cubicle together and this is my cubicle my chair which i share with my d4 uh then i just we looked at the schedule and then we just started to get ready for the long list of patients ahead we had around five patients scheduled for today and our first patient was actually a molar rct patient so we got all the equipment that we needed and we also set the chair put chair covers and everything after that around 11 o'clock i was really tired and i headed out for some coffee this is our college cafeteria where you have free coffee all day <laughs> when i say free coffee just just letting you know it is not starbucks coffee or it's not even duncan but it's coffee and you know it kind of helps us to survive the day i mean um on such hectic days i sometimes even forget to eat and me and my partner we both like work from 8 a.m to 6 p.m just sometimes you don't even take a break so i was glad i found a coffee break and i made the best use out of it and this is me grabbing a cup of coffee here then i just headed out to sit in the cafeteria for a while while i sipped on my coffee because our next patient was actually after i think 25 minutes so i just took that time to check all my emails and see how the day is going to go ahead after that i headed back and we were again preparing for another patient after that patient there was another patient so this is around three o'clock we were setting the chair i was setting the chair while my partner uh kind of went to get the instruments and set up the tray uh so we could get ready for the patient now i finally got time to have some food and i just got like five minutes and i decided to take that time and this is me just towards the end of the day this patient the one that we did right now was the i, I would say the toughest i mean we did a post and core on a patient on a molar and it took like two hours <laughs> more than that and usually everyone le leaves it by like six o'clock but here am i leaving by 6 45 me and my partner we both left super late because as i told you the last patient's appointment was for 90 minutes but it ended up you know being for 120 minutes you can look at my face and tell i'm pretty tired right now i don't even care about anything i just want to get home I'm walking back towards my home and I'm super tired right now. Oh. So hi guys, you can clearly see I'm just back home and you can clearly see 
I'm really tired. I still have the marks from N95 mask on my face. And I just came home. It's seven o'clock. There's no food at home. And I'm just, just too lazy to go outside or even to have to use my brain to decide if I should order something. So I'm just gonna go and make something. I mean, what else can I do now? So I just had some of this leftover noodles and I think I'm just gonna, you know, have these right now. And then once I get a bit of energy, probably I'll look for some other source of nutrition that I can find in my fridge. So I also had some boiled potatoes, which I stuffed in inside uh, this bread with some uh, minced chutney. Uh, and then I have this, so this is gonna be pretty much my dinner. Okay, so I'm really hungry, so I'm like, you know, going to make a smoothie right now. So all of these are frozen fruits. Those are some blackberries. And then I have some of my frozen strawberries. So I'm just gonna add some more. And now time to add some milk to it. made almost something like a slushy because it was all iced and I'm just gonna put it all in here so I can like you know eat it like water. so this is what I'm having this is my slushy right here and then I also had some frozen like samosas mini samosas so this is like leftovers and like this is what is pretty much my dinner. So I'm just going to answer some quick questions that you might have after watching my vlog today. So I have this clinic twice a week. Apart from that, I have other clinics like oral surgery, periodontics, like you know, the 1A clinic as we call it every once a, once in a while but every Monday and Thursday I have my morning 8 a.m. or Thursdays 9 a.m. to almost like 6 to 7 p.m. clinic and it gets really hectic sometimes I have an exam right the day after on one day we treat somewhere between four to five patients at the bare minimum and <clears throat> We usually work with a D4 and like, you know, alternate uh, patients, like three patients are done by D4, two by D3s. But these days as we have just started, so we are like, you know, we are just assisting and trying to do some procedures, but like limited procedures right now. Now I just have to do a quiz. So I have to take a quiz right now. And I'm taking that. So I've put in all the answers and now it's like time to submit. So I'm really tired. I think I'm gonna go sleep now. Thank you so much for watching my vlog and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.